<laughs> hey, welcome to a new video. Now you know what time it is. It's iPhone season. So we had the new iPhone 14. Now these are the 14 Pros Standard Edition. Um, one is purple, one is black. Um, yeah, I actually ordered two purples and one black, but only these two have shown up. One is a couple days behind for some reason. Um, I wasn't going to get new phones this year, but T-Mobile gave me an offer I couldn't refuse. So I am going to get three, three new phones this year. I'm going to switch, so I'm recording this with an iPhone 13 Pro Max. I'm going back to the normal size because the, the Max over the last year is sometimes hard to deal with. Uh, especially when you're trying to do one hand texting and you're trying to walk fast, all that stuff. So anyways, great screen, having the big screen is nice. But I am interested to see how the new phone is. Uh, with the new, um, what do I call that, the island? And the screen is supposed to be twice as bright in the sun. That's something I've noticed that on iPhone 14, sorry, 13 Pro Max is that outside in the sun, it kind of, it's not great. Even though it's supposed to be really good, but anyways, um, simple video. We're going to unbox this, turn the camera around, read about it. I do like there's no plastic on this year's box. That's cool. Um, now this one had some rough shipping. As you can tell, it's dented. Um, even on the back right here, look, you can see right there, looks like it's kind of like marked off. So in the box, you, you, you could kind of see that it was an iPhone in the box itself. It was kind of weird. Um, the black phone's fine. So we're going to unbox both of these and look at them. Um, we're going to replace this iPhone 11 with this black Pro. So that should be cool. Um, this one says it need, needs a new battery. So we're going to um, just trade it in. So, and uh, yeah. Thanks for being here. Like, like comment, subscribe. Simple video. Um, yeah, let's flip the camera around and look at it. All right, so let's do the black one first. Let's see what the black one looks like. So we peel here and we peel here and that's it. Oh, it sure is. And you pull up and there she be. Oh, I like it, the black on the sides. That's cool, I didn't, didn't expect that. Nice, let's see what we get this year. We get that charging cable and that's it. We come to expect that and assume you get an Apple logo. You no longer need a physical SIM card. Activate your eSIM during iPhone setup. For more information, go to apple.com slash eSIM. We will do that, and I will explain how it worked for us. I'm not going to show much of it due to privacy issues. So that was the black one. That's cool. Let's look at the purple one now. Your doggy. I guess I should have shown what it says on it. iPhone 14 Pro, designed by Apple in California, symboled in China, includes that, that, and um, yeah. Not much else. Let's see how the purple looks. almost black on camera. Yeah, it's really dark. Yeah. So, that's how they look. I'm digging the black. I like the black a lot. Wow, that's nice. So, Let's just get closer. Okay. That is satisfying. 
nice and flat. The cameras are huge. So, I mean, let's compare them to just the, I mean, look at the, it's hard to get it on camera, but look at the size of the camera. So the sensors are much bigger on the new one. Of course, this is the 11, which takes good, good photos and video, by the way, but yeah. Then let's take this one off. Wow, that's nice. For, yeah, this is a good size. Perfect size right here. So I'm going to, uh, wow, look at the, I didn't even notice the flash is huge. It's a variable flash this year, so this should be interesting. So I'm gonna get one set up so we can uh, finish this video. So um, I'll be back. So I guess we can show what happens when you first turn it on. So let's hit power. There's Apple. I'm seeing that. That's cool. We are in the United States. Bring your current iPhone or iPad near this iPhone to sign in and set up. And now in person, it doesn't look as good as what I'm seeing on my camera shot. But yeah, let me get this set up and we will be back. So I use this phone to scan a thing on this phone and now it's linking them together. Pretty nice. And just like that, this one is now, we transfer everything from here to here. And it did not take long. So if you saw the time earlier, that's how long it took. Not bad. So I've already erased this one all the way too. So it's ready for trade-in. So when you do get your iPhone unboxed, ready to go, set up, all that stuff, you are gonna have to do an update. So right here, 331 megabytes. Um, the screen's hard to read right here for some reason on the lights, but in my hand it looks fine. But we're gonna download and install, enter your password, and do the update. So she's never had a, a pro model. And it says, um, set up your style, rich contrast, vibrant, warm, cool. I think for her, we're gonna go with standard. There we go. Hmm. Looks kind of warm and in interesting. Anyways, this is show us our, so you've got 0.5, 1, 2, and 3. So we'll, we'll play around with this more in the future. Okay, well, let's do in this little update. I'm gonna show you the case that she picked out. Hopefully it goes good with this because she should have probably got the purple phone with her case. There's a tree in my background, but that's fine. So this is a case that she, she picked out. It's nice. It's supposed to have good protection, but let's see what we think. I always go left first. Hopefully that's what I need to do. So yeah, good protection for the front. As you can see there, let's see about camera. Decent protection for the camera. I wouldn't say, I mean, I like to normally be exposed a little bit more than that, but that's fine. And it feels good in hand. And the clicker feels good. Volume buttons feel good. And you can, then you can see that, that uh, what, what, whatever that is. The island, is that what they say? Okay, it all moves. Nice. Um, camera on. Camera's nice and bright. Camera off. Go to the camera. And it dims. Oh, because it's an always on screen. I forget it's an always on screen. That's something new, always on the screen, so that's nice. Hmm, 
interesting. So there we go, it is updated. So that's the new dynamic island. I don't know, there's multiple things that happens. You play playing music, it'll be there. Um, let's see if I can find some music and we can just show that. Okay, off. so I have some music playing on Apple Music. Now see, I thought you can control volume and stuff, but that's not happening. I know I can hold this down and it shows you what's playing. And you go back and it's, it's just like that. So, I mean, is that necessary? I don't, I don't think so. But if I could to control my volume doing this, that'd be cool. But I, I guess I could do it on the sides. But yeah, that's that. Yeah, even the black looks, looks great in this thing. So yeah, iPhone 14 Pro with the always on display and it's showing you what's on. Cause that's, that was off. See that, how it dims. Let's just get rid of music and then we'll see what's going on here. Oh, okay, the music is gone. So let's see, lock it. And that's the screen. You can see how it brightens up. But that's the always on screen, which I assume you can go to settings and change it, but I'm not. Let's see the lock there. Yeah, it's cool. So that's it for this video. Um, this is just like a little tour of it. Uh, iPhone 14 Pro. I did not get any of the nor normal models, so um, they gave us great deals on the Pros. So I went ahead and just went with the Pros. So it's cool. It's nice. Thousand bucks. Trade in your phone, and you get them for free. Almost free. So yeah, it is what it is with these phones. Uh, thanks for being here. Uh, I'm gonna make some videos. I'm gonna do up update mine. Uh, my new one and I'm going to get rid of this one and all my future videos will be using iPhone 14 Pro So thanks for being here like comment subscribe until next one. Bye. Bye